for? You just mentioned investors. Um, I love to ask you know all of our guests and what they think of raising money, and you're uh, you're advising certain startups right now. Uh, what what are your thoughts on bootstrapping versus raising money? Is there there's really no right answer, but how, what's the nuances around that? Because there's it's it's difficult. It is difficult. Um, so the, the the investment market has changed dramatically just in the last few years. Mm-hmm. One thing that's you can say for sure is that there are enough savvy angel folk around who've done it before, who can possibly bootstrap, help you bootstrap, and. <coughs> And avoid that whole notion of going to get money from the VC world, yeah. right? Now, swings and roundabouts. Um, it's important not to get too wound up about money. That is, if the idea is big enough, then actually how you organize the cap table on day one is relatively unimportant yeah. by comparison with the end point, right? Yep. And so agility and ability to move faster with more money is probably better. Um, and owning, you know, 15 or 16 percent of your company, who cares, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, <coughs> to my mind, <laughs> the key thing is to find investors or advisors who will really help you transform the way you build a business. They can come with money or without, but number one is to get the advice, right? Yeah. Now, most of the big VC firms will put in seed level funding nowadays because they've found that they're competing with the angels. Exactly. Yeah. Um, to my mind. It's really about a personal match. You need to find somebody who will help you guide guide the growth of your business. The problem with the VC folks is that they don't have the capacity to do with lots and lots of itsy bitsy investments, and so it gets they go through this winnowing, which is when you come up for air and you want real money. They can choose not to do yeah. it. Yeah, which is not a good situation for a startup to be in because it does signal to other investors. You know, it's like, well, why aren't they putting money in? Not to say it's the end of the world, but um, you know, I, I think that that's a caution. If you're taking money, seed money from a VC firm, if they don't follow on, is that a challenge? Or is oh, that, it absolutely yeah. is. In fact, what you need to know is this: the big VC firms have got enough money that they're totally okay to burn a few hundred thousand dollars to destroy yeah. something that they don't want to exist. Okay. You're right. And I have seen that happen. Wow. Yeah. It's not common, but they do. It, it happens. Because yeah. they know they have a competitive play yeah. that they'd rather have, right? Yeah.